Muay Thai, it's Thailand's most ancient martial art. And while it may resemble Western boxing, almost anything goes here. Hands, head, feet, knees, even elbows, it's all legitimate. It's thought that ancient warriors trained in Muay Thai or Thai boxing to defend their nation from invaders. Now it's one of Thailand's most popular sports, part of every festival, and broadcast throughout the country every day. Some of the most successful boxers got their start here in the northern hills of Chiang Mai at the Iana Muay Thai training camp. Today, this is home for 12-year-old Manat and 15 other aspiring fighters. Most are young, from very poor families, and are supported by the camp. While here, they live to box, training seven hours a day, seven days a week. For Manat and the others, competitive success here could lead to better lives. Physical strength isn't enough. They must be disciplined and steadfast in their preparation. But modern Muay Thai does more than make warriors out of athletes. It makes dreamers out of boys. If I move on to bigger fights, one day I'll be a champion, a champion of Chiang Mai. I'll feel very proud and good, and I'll send the money I win to my parents. Manat's big night has arrived. The fight is in Hongdong, a small village outside Chiang Mai. Manat proceeds to the ring for the Ram Muay, an ancient ceremony that focuses a fighter's strength and power. The fight begins. The judges are looking for uh, good clean shot technique, both offensive and defensive. They are looking for the boxer who is in control of the fight. For Manat, tonight is not the night. His opponent is taller, heavier, and more experienced. But despite those disadvantages, Manat makes a strong showing. He loses the fight, but he wins the confidences of his coaches. <laughs> 